Ready? was sadly completely shrouded in fog. We found Minnesota in the same foggy state, but we were determined to enjoy the superior lakeshore at whatever cost. Piercing through the fog, steep cliffs, and dark, calm water below. head stood as the magnificent ghostly prow of a ship breaking the waves. As morning wore on, the fog began to evaporate and Minnesota's beauty unfurled. We are at the Gooseberry Falls State Park in Minnesota along the Superior Lakeshore. Awesome. One thing you'll uh, learn about me on this trip is I love waterfalls. So uh, this yeah. is a great place to uh, take a break. Once again, we headed inland to the heart of Minnesota's lake country. Hogback Lake is situated far back dirt roads in the Superior National Forest. A long and scenic drive through pine forests, gushing streams, and sparkling, almost painfully beautiful lakes. Okay, so we have made it to our destination, right? Um, which is what is the forest? National Forest. Okay. And uh, that is Hogback Lake. This is our campsite. There's the lake. Okay, but we still need to spray ourselves because they're still biting us. Because we're right by the lake. Oh my gosh, no! The next day we attempted a hike and the mosquitoes caught up with us again, chewing through DEET and long sleeves. It is almost torture to be surrounded by beautiful lakes and be unable to swim. So we headed southwest and happened upon Whiteface Reservoir, a massive lake with bathrooms, water, beaches, and most importantly, a distinct lack of mosquitoes. I don't have a mosquito on me. It's wonderful. So um, we're going to enjoy ourselves a whole lot. Hopefully you'll enjoy us being happy in this video rather than terrified. Baldy 
eagle circled overhead. Can you see? Certainly a good omen oh, on our all-American road trip. I'm recording. Are you? Yeah. That's an eagle. We've never seen an eagle. Look at his white head. Oh my goodness! <laughs> this is what I signed up for. As night crept in, we found ourselves in one of a campsite. So, oh, turn left. So we are trying another place. We're going to Atasca, which is where we really wanted to be anyway. We just didn't want to pay to be there. All our old Michigan troubles came back in a hurry. And then so we decide to break down and pay to stay at a camp with a shower. Uh, the park's closed. Atasca State Park, which we've heard is wonderful, was both closed and buzzing with mosquitoes as well. And so, running low on fuel, sleep, and energy, we set our course toward Fargo, North Dakota, hoping to head south to South Dakota from there. Luckily, as both of us were starting to space out on the dark highway, we found a great campsite. Now that's what I call living. <laughs> 